Ripley's, believe it or not, Myrtle Beach. Hey everybody, Tom here for Tom's Road Trip and I am at Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. I'm gonna check out Ripley's, believe it or not, auditorium of Myrtle Beach. I've been to multiple Ripley's auditoriums as they are known all around the country. Been wanting to come here. I did the aquarium earlier, so if you'd like to see that, look under my aquariums tab in my videos. Right outside before you go in, legendary fertility statues. But of course, we're not allowed to touch them right now. Some stuff we'll see inside. And some Ripley's rarities. Recycled tire gorilla. And that's a big gorilla. They complete out of recycled tires. The wiring. But the water is still flowing. How's that possible? Vampire woman. Reflection on part of it. The Burmese tattoo set. All right, going up the stairs. Got some pharaoh on the wall. The Kamala, the Indian wolf girl. Reproduction, of course. Not really her. It's all about Robert Ridley. So Robert Ripley collected all sorts of items from around the world. Got a pig head totem on the left. Skull bean necklace. Alright, back here we got a Tibetan human bone rosary. They got a Kenyan brass earrings. And a sheep. And a bird beak war club. These are all authentic artifacts. Got a genuine shrunken head. A real shrunken head. Trouble masks. Modern soul boat. Got the leg 
legacy of King Tutankhamun's tomb. Yeah. Real mummified hand. Is it rap money? It's all about the the curse. This one died mysteriously of unknown clothes. Robert Wadlow. 2.6 and 1929. Robert Wadlow. It is believe it or not, our This boy kept growing in the This was the actual height. But the rest of his brothers and sisters. 8 foot 11, and he died at age 22 from an infection. As a tour. It's a long neck woman. So as the rings were added, it forced the rib cage and everything else down as it pulled the neck up. Actual rings. X-ray that was taken. One of the other eyes is called four eyes. Because he had two pupils in each eye. And Lighthouse Man. And sort of candle into his head. And that's what we do towards the human unicorn. And a horn growing out of his head. Thirteen inch horn. There's all sorts of pages from the Ripley's magazine throughout the years. All sorts of facts. A lot of just odd stuff. Robert Waldro to Willie Camper. He put five and a half inches tall. The size of his hand. Here's my hand for comparison. Got a junk art hand. All sorts of different pieces of junk. Pedal record, lock of hair. It's the real hair she had cut off. Six feet four inches long. More interesting artifacts. It's kind of disgusting and cool looking. The cheap gum sculptures. You got the alphabet. All made out of chewed gum. Substitute ancestor head for New Guinea. Coco de Mara Monk's begging bowl. This. A two headed cat skull. A ceremonial Chris dagger. This. Got an elephant bird egg. Good stuff in here. You got a Vietnamese root carb chip. And that's fantastic. Hand carved. Got an elephant's foot humidor. Got a two headed lamb. It's a two headed six legged cow. Obviously, a conjoined twin. 
The animals didn't usually live very long. It's John Arnold, six legged, Poland China boar. Got it six months old. Uh, got a lighthouse painted on a sawfish beak. Got the world's longest chewing gum wrapper chain. Well, this is only part of it. It just shows you the length of this thing was. I can imagine how many cavities they got chewing all that gum. They got a Tibetan ram skull. Other oddities that are in here. Alaska walrus teeth money. And a voodoo fetish basket. And a Fiji mermaid. Body of a fish and the, the top portion of a monkey to try to pass off as being a real mermaid. Japanese ceremonial dragon sword. A Tibetan skull bowl. A recycled sculpture cricket lamp. Cool the genuine vampire killing kit circa 1850. Trophy skull rack. Got torture devices. Full body shackle. Thumb screw. Flesh pinchers. Ugh. Executioner's sword. Torture collar. Get genuine, get genuine torture implements. Get a mace. Of course, got stocks. Imagine being locked in this thing till you die. Probably one of the most brutal. Torture devices with the Iron Maiden. See the spikes in it. You're stuck inside and the doors are shut. The spikes pierce you. The wax replica of Franklin D. Roosevelt. Yeah, this is really neat. The open flag is made out of first, second, and third place ribbons that she won over the years. Lincoln and Grave Car Hood. Which is insanely heavy, but not as heavy as a ball eagle's nest, which can weigh up to two tons. A miniature wood carved general store. This one we also have matchsticks. A replica of the Statue of Liberty. Wow, wait. <laughs> this is funny, got a bubblegum Donald Trump. It's a 39 star Dakota flag. A Donald Trump signed golf ball. A Donald Trump signed boxing glove. Didn't realize he ever boxed. Presidential miniature paintings. Genuine hair of President Lincoln. Hair of President Washington. Here's one of the matchstick sculptures. Got a matchstick roller coaster. Wow, this looks like a, be a fun roller coaster. And there are 30,000 matchsticks. 40 feet of track. As part of their courtship ritual, pairs of bald eagles perform a cartwheel dance soaring high into the sky, walking their toes. 
Ripley's collection of presidential letters, photos, and signatures. Got the Lincoln Bugle. Got butterfly wing art. And Penny Musiak, John Lennon. Oh, that's fantastic. Got a jelly bean Van Gogh. Awesome. Yeah, all the jelly beans right there. Got feather art. Abe Lincoln, continuous line drawing. We've got a sauropod dinosaur nest. Allosaurus foot. Get some dinosaurs. King and lizard. King of the Lizards. All right, so he's made completely out of car parts and recycled machinery parts. That is awesome. Got an Allosaurus skull. I mean, look at them choppers on him. Got a Utah Raptor skeleton. Ancestor head. See it all the way at the bottom. Got 
antique wall mount phone, 1876, car parts robot. They don't call it a transformer, but that's essentially what it is. They got a car parts. It's cool, they got a Lego Illusion Batman and the Joker. You see from this angle, looks like Batman. But then when you move it aside, it's the Joker! It's really neat. Depending on where you stand, got a Chinese G dragon boat. Completely out of jade. South Carolina. Some quirkiness in there. It's actually one of the smaller Ripley's I've been in, but there was some unique stuff I haven't seen before. A lot of repeat items that are throughout all the auditoriums around the country, but still a fun place to come. Get another Ripley's off of my list of the ones to go. I'm hoping to visit all of them in the United States. So if you like what you saw, give me a thumbs up. And leave me some comments down below if you had any comments or questions. If you haven't already subscribed, subscribe to my channel. I've got all sorts of videos coming up. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Bye.